Okay, so you guys have a uh, Android device, a smartphone or tablet, and you forgot your passcode on here, or it could be a number passcode, uh, pretty much whatever it is. Uh, the only way at this time to get into this is basically you're going to do a hard reset, and that's basically going to erase all of your data. So it'll back, actually bring your phone back up to it as like you just opening, uh, it's a brand new phone out of the box. Now the thing is, like, there used to be a way you can crack this. Uh, you, have, you have to push like the emergency. I mean, it it was on certain Android phones, but you can click the emergency button or the emergency call and do a couple things here and then push the power button. But the thing is, the good thing is Android uh, updated all its software, so you're not able to do that. And that's actually a good thing because um, you know if your phone ever gets lost or stolen, um, no one's going to be able to retrieve your data. And uh, in, even if there is. A way now to crack into this without losing anything uh, it shouldn't be posted um, for you know privacy reasons for thieves and whatnot uh, getting your data so anyways uh, again you forgot your um, your passcode your number code or whatever and you want to get in you got to do a hard reset pretty much all the phones are uh, similar uh, depending on what phone you want to uh, you have it might be a different um, a different way to do it like for instance I'm using the s3 it's a it's a three button, um, you, have to, you have to hold down three buttons. For example, the phones you might have to hold down only two buttons, like the volume up and down the same time and the power. With the Galaxy S3, what you do is you have to hold uh, the power up, or the volume up, the power, and the home button. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys how to do a hard reset on this phone. And first thing you gotta do is you have to reboot this computer, or reboot this um, phone. Actually, what you wanna do is you wanna shut, power it off completely. Let it shut down, and I will continue once my phone is booted back, or oh, once my phone is completely off. Okay, so my phone is completely off now, and now what you want to do, like I said, this is the Galaxy S3. Different phones will have different combinations. For the, for the Galaxy S3, or, or a lot of the Galaxy S's, what you want to do is you want to hold up the uh, volume button, the up volume button, hold down the home button, and hold down this power button. So you want to hold it down, and I'm holding it down, and you want to wait until you see this little blue text that was up there, or some of you, depending on what phone you have, you may have a little Android guy. As soon as this, as soon as you see that, you can let everything go, and just wait. And now from here, you guys can see this here, and to navigate on here, you would push the uh, the volume key, the up or down. So for instance, on here. What we want to go to is we want to go to where it says wipe data factory reset. And in order to select that, we have to push the power button. Push the power button. And then from here, what we want to do is we want to go all the way down, delete all user data. So remember, guys, once you do this, it's going to delete everything on your phone, pictures, files, apps, whatever you have on there, it's going to delete it. And this is going to make pretty much make your phone like brand new as if you just took it out of the box. So I'm going to select this, I'm going to push the power button. Now I'm going to wait for it to go through this little process here. Now it says wiping data, formatting data. Okay, great. Now it says on the bottom here, it says uh, data wipe complete. And then what we want to do is we want to restart or reboot our um, cell phone now. It says uh, reboot system now. It's already on there. And what I do is I just push the power button again. And let this uh, boot back up. And from here, like I said, it should be pretty much like a brand new phone. All the data is wiped off. There's nothing on here as if it's just a brand new phone out of the box. And then of course from here you have to go through your like introductory phase and um, just do like a couple steps on here and uh, that's pretty much it. So you this way you'll be able to, this is the only way as of right now to bypass your code. And like I said, if there is another way to get uh, bypass that um, passcode without losing your data, um, it shouldn't be noted anywhere on the internet. So if you guys need any help or anything, just comment in the bottom and I'll get back to you when I can. Thanks. Bye.